Hey everybody, Mark from StickReview.com, and tonight we're bringing you a review of the Crow Magnum Knuckle Dragger. And uh, to be honest, I've heard about these on Twitter and Facebook from some of my uh, fellow brothers of the Leaf, but I've never tried any. And uh, thanks to Daniel, you guys may know him as ABN Cigar Fan out there. Um, he went ahead and gifted me a whole nice cigar bomb, and in them was four different sizes of the... Uh, Magnums. This one was the smallest one in there, so it's about midnight. I only have about an hour and a half, so I figured I'd kick it off with the knuckle dragger. And so far, I have to say, it is very full-bodied. Um, I went ahead and did a regular straight cut on it. A little resistance at the beginning draw. It's a little bit tighter, uh, tighter construction. It's not really too loose, but it also could be because it was a couple days in transit. But I just couldn't uh, couldn't help myself. Had to try one right away. But so far, really full-bodied, and the, I think it's going to be right up my alley. But we'll wait and see how it develops in a little bit. Hey everybody, checking back in. And I have to say, I am a damn fool for not trying these things earlier. Um, as you can see, it's got a really nice dark wrapper. Very, very oily. But uh, as you guys know, I'm a big fan of full-bodied, peppery, spicy sticks. And this is already hitting it out of the ballpark. It's got tons of spice, tons of pepper. It's just uh, huge clouds of smoke. It's, it's really a full-bodied spicy smoker's dream. Uh, I looked at the price point on these because, again, it was gifted to me. It looked like they're anywhere between uh, 7 and $10, depending upon where you pick them up. And uh, uh, so far, I'm thoroughly, thoroughly enjoying this. Again, I don't have too much info to give you on these because I just haven't done much research. Uh, but so far, it is fabulous. Uh, really, really good full-bodied. If you like a bold, spicy, peppery cigar, uh, this one might be for you. Uh, can't wait to keep going and see how it develops. Hey everybody, checking back in. Probably about 25, 30 minutes in. And uh, I'm going to have this be the last segment because of two reasons. One, I really want to enjoy this. And two, I'm running low on battery. Uh, but I'm definitely, definitely liking this. I'm definitely going to try to find out where I can pick up more of these. I can't get them locally, so I'm going to reach out to some of my brothers at Leaf out there and see if they can help me get some more. Um, just a real spicy, peppery powerhouse. And that's really all I can say about this. I have three other varieties I'm going to try. Again, thanks to Daniel. He sent over a bunch of them. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, you know, try them all out. But so far, if you're a really full-bodied smoker that likes pepper, likes spice, I recommend trying these out. Uh, I'm going to put links in the uh, bottom of the video to where you can get these and all that information. I'll be honest, I didn't really do much research, just decided to uh, cut it up and spark it up. So the research part and where you can get them and all will be in the links. But definitely go ahead and try these out. They're in a decent price range where you can't complain. Again, simple, no band. Uh, again, the construction on them is pretty good. You really can't complain. A little booting here and there, but it's smoking clean after I got through the beginning of it. And a nice white ash, good smoke. Loving it. Uh, keep checking out stickreview.com and look for more information on these in the comments.